back to my youtube channel it's me and bella again and i am back with another video Two, three, let's switch this up. this video has been requested a lot and for a while and i'm finally giving it to you guys and i hope that you enjoy it if you do don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and click on the notification bell to be updated so you don't miss a single video that i post so as you can see i'm not in my usual set i am home in verona because it's the summer holidays and i moved out of my dorm but before leaving i didn't forget you guys I knew that um, you wanted to see my dorm, so before leaving, I decided to like take a few clips for you to see what you can get once you move to a dorm in Venice. So for First Creek University, there are a few dorms, and I've only lived in two. I've lived in the Combo dorm. I'll link the link up here for you to check it out, and I've also lived in Campus Santa Marta, which is the one that I'm going to show you right now. The room is pretty much empty and because I forgot to like film a dorm tour during my stay in that dorm, um, but I hope you enjoy it in a ways and to be honest this is what you're gonna get once you move because I left the room how I found it so that is exactly what you're gonna get. Also guys, let me know if you want a video on how to find accommodation um, in Venice and I'll make one as well. And also I didn't leave the prices of the dorm room because they pretty change every year. So I didn't want to like write something incorrect. So um, if you want to check out the prices and check out the dorms and if you're planning to live in a dorm check out the link in the description below it's the link of my university and it will pretty much give you all the information that you need it's in english i'll also upload the link in italian for italian students and now let's get right into the video <music> guys so let me walk you through on how this dorm room looks so first of all on your left you're gonna find a little space for your coats and your shoes next to it there are two identical closets one for you and one for your future roommates they are quite spacious and you're also gonna find a few hangers in there and I forgot to show you, but I'm going to show you again. There is also a built-in mirror, which in my opinion is amazing. Now on the opposite side of the wardrobes, there is the bathroom. So it's a very small bathroom, but it's very efficient and clean. There is a mirror, there is a sink, there is a place to hang your towels, a bidet and a toilet, and a shower, which is quite small, but it's, it's good, it's good. At least you don't have to share it with other people except for your roommate, which is great in my opinion. So next on your left you're going to find the kitchen which consists in a small conduction stove and a small sink and below these two there is the fridge which also has a very small freezer and next to it there is enough space for you to put your trash. On top of these two, you're gonna find a cupboard where you can put your food or whatever you want and space for your dishes.
Next to the kitchen, there is a cupboard with a microwave in it. To be honest, I never use it, but it could be quite useful if you want to heat up something very fast. And there is also space for your cutlery and room to put your food or whatever you want to put inside there. Next to it, there is the study area, which I also use as my dining area because there is no table. So if you want to eat on a table, you have to eat in there. And I love the ceiling and the lights, very modern. And finally, there are two beds, one for you and one for your roommate. As you saw, each bed has a nightstand, bedside table, and below that, there is enough space for you to put other clothing. So trust me, there is enough room to put your stuff because even though it's small, it's a very functional room. Now I'm showing you the little terrace or whatever and this is my view from my room and i think it's gorgeous now i'm gonna show you the extra things that you can find in here so if you go on the ground floor or fast floor if you're american you are gonna find the laundry room but it's not free you have to pay to wash your laundry next I'm going to show you the gym. It is quite small, but it has the essential things. I usually use the treadmill, especially in winter because it's very cold. Or I ride my spin bike, which I really love. And that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you soon.